हेलो हाय दर्श नमस्ते दिस इज मेरे गर्ल ऑफ सराज सर बैक विद यू नदी यूट्यूब वीडियो रात जो सब बिल्ला मेरे यूट्यूब चैनल में साइज़ इस आगे से कती चैनल चैनल सब्सक्राइब कर दी सकने वाले को सब देरी देरी दरने बाद तक कती चैनल गांड वाले को साइन एंड प्लीज चैनल से सब्सक्राइब कर दी न two years of your MBBS because uh, um, uh, MBBS is all is all about the study and so if you do not prefer a good textbook and only referring to the uh, books wouldn't solve your uh, wouldn't make your concept clear so there are you need to study smart okay so um, studying like uh, uh, only books for um, 20 19 hours it wouldn't solve or it wouldn't make your concept clear so you need to have a very broad thinking that uh, you need to refer to the other textbooks um, other books that are available so to make your concept clear and you need to watch videos so it would be all about those things in this video so please stay tuned till the last so um, uh, without further is uh, wasting time i'll be starting this video basically six of this while you need to study during your first two years so starting from the anatomy anatomy is all about the architecture how bird is made up of right so um, do not take it lightly and you need to study anatomy very hard and um uh, actually you need to study all those six of this very hard but um, anatomy is uh, uh, like you need to um, uh, simply imagine and sim and memorize the things so it's all about anatomy so for the anatomy uh, you to take is a more clinically oriented anatomy um some of the people might uh, think it is very bad and it is very heavy book uh, but um, while studying it you need you will really enjoy it and for certain topics that uh, uh, you think um, it is not uh, really uh, needed that much uh, that is given in the mood you can go always go for the video chorus which is always always um, the favorite um, anatomy book for most of the students uh, in India and Nepal so uh, you can always rely upon the video chorus for those topics that are not that much required during your first two years right okay so um, for the um, anatomy i'll just uh, say more clinically oriented anatomy because uh, there are lots of clinical scenarios that are given in the more uh, but in case of British they are also given but uh, um, more is a uh, more of a concept based uh, um, book while uh, British Odyssey is more of a memorizing type um, uh, it is based on the memorization so uh, British Odyssey yeah, you can go side by side you can make notes you can make just compare yeah there is no comparison but uh, you can just uh, rely upon this more and then British Odyssey yeah. okay so for the uh, Imperialism is one of the most important um, 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 field in uh, case of the anatomy so uh, for the embryology you need to study very smartly because uh, during um, I said my experience while studying uh, embryology I, it, it was uh, never a fun topic for me to study embryology because I never understand it and it uh, requires lots of imagination right for the embryology so um, only studying language I will not understand anything right so but uh, after I discovered Vishram Singh and uh, uh, eight my life was so easy like it's, I, I, I would study with Bishram Singh and then I will move towards the Langman so there, my concept was um, crystal clear for the embryology and uh, watching some videos it would make a uh, cherry on top so um, I'll just um, request uh, or if there is someone who can study Langman all alone and can understand the concept then it is well and good but those who are like me who, who are struggling to get concept uh, for the embryology you can go for the Bishram Singh first of all study Bishram Singh and then you all can all and then you can go for the Langman because it is our standard textbook so um studying something and language side by side it would make uh, your life very easy for the embryology you can always go for the snails neuroanatomy it is the best book that is always available for the um neuroanatomy second book that is physiology physiology is all about the how her body is functioning and how homeostasis of the body is maintained so um, it's also a very quite interesting subject and for the physiology you there is no any hard and fast rule and you can easily understand from your standard textbook that is Guyton and Hall so you need to buy your um, latest edition I think that is 13th or I might be wrong so um, for physiology it is always number one Guyton and Hall third book that is pathology pathology is all about how disease is 
uh, occurring, how disease is changing our body and how um, body is reacting to the uh, disease. So um, it's all about, it's a very quite interesting subject also. Every six subjects are quite interesting. Um, so for the pathology, no one and only book that you can read is our standard textbook that Robinson Cutran Pathological Basis of Disease, right? So please, 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 I kindly request you to study Robinson Cutran for um, thoroughly. You can you can easily understand the pathology and it is also quite fun studying Robinson Cutran. It's never a boring subject to study pathology. So always go for the Robinson Cutran, okay? Fourth book that you need to study is Pharmacology. Pharmacology is the subject that deals with the drugs that you need to prescribe to the patient according to the disease condition. So, pharmacology has never an easy job for me while studying um, MBBS during the first two years of my MBBS. So, um, because pharmacology is such a subject that um, I think everyone tends to saw, forget and no one is able to memorize everything about the pharmacology. And there are a list of long drugs that you need to memorize, right? So, um, actually I used to struggle studying pharmacology during my first two years of MBBS. So, getting to understand while in my entrance that pharmacology is such an understanding uh, proper basic also you need to study the becomes clear. So, there are uh, one is the Kharjang Basics and Clinical Pharmacology, right? So, it is a book that is uh, that will make your concept real really 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 concept uh, clear so i'll really request every students of the first uh, two year to study cat junk basis and clinical pharmacology book uh, for, and you can always uh, take the on the second book uh, that is KD Tripathi. KD Tripathi is a book that is mostly based on the memorization while Kajang is mostly based on the um, uh, understanding the concept and uh, how and why is answered in uh, Kajang but in case of KD Tripathi there is a list that you need to memorize and then you are done. So you can um, go side by side so there is no any hard and fast rule uh, so you can go for either of them or you can go for the both of them okay and there is another book that is called pharmacology Lipping called pharmacology is the book that doesn't find is easy and some of it some of them finds very easy to understand concepts so i'm referring you also the Lipping cut pharmacology book okay so you can go for the three books for the pharmacology that is a cat zone and the second one is scary Party, and the third one is Lipping cut pharmacology okay fifth one is biochemistry Biochemistry is this object that deals with the enzyme hormone cycles at the molecular basis, right? So it's about the new technologies that we study in the biochemistry, how the body is um, molecular level is functioning and how um, the signals are transmitted. <clears throat> transduced so uh, biochemistry is also a really interesting topic to um, study so for the uh, biochemistry you can always go for our standard textbook that is Harper's biochemistry but uh, I find it very vast for the first two years so uh, this is my um, personal uh, um, suggestion uh, um, because um, there are some of the people, there are some of the students who study Harper's biochemistry. So I'm not uh, saying anything to those, but to those who are struggling to study biochemistry, those who are finding biochemistry very difficult, you can always go for the um, to understand. You can always go for the videos, and you can go for the textbooks that are available, like uh, Satinara, and you can also go for the Satinara. It's not a ba bad book. Uh, prefer uh, Harper's biochemistry. You can study from that to make your own concepts very clear and the last one is a lipping cut biochemistry so those three are for the biochemistry Harper's biochemistry, lipping cut biochemistry and lastly uh, Satinara sixth and final book that you need to study is for the basic science it's a microbiology microbiology is a subject that is also very volatile and it's also very hard to memorize all those microorganisms that are quite similar well, you cannot just memorize microbiology i think so because uh, there are certain uh, there are so many microorganisms that have similar characteristics but there is one uh, difference so it's very one of you to just um, make a, a comparison chart about each and other each microorganism so it should be an easy uh, um, uh, topic for you to study or maybe to memorize during your last uh, minutes of exam. So, um, for the microbiology, Sakrabarti or Anantanarayan, you can always go for that because uh, I uh, personally I have uh, studied Sakrabarti and it was a very quite a book, um, interesting and it was a very nicely written book. So, I always 
I have studied Chakravarti for my microbiology and my other friends used to study Ananda Narayan so there is no any hard and fast rule that you can study either of them and for the parasitology that we need to study we can always go for the Chatterjee and then also another um, uh, parasite and lastly and but not least there is also community medicine that we need to study so for the community medicine there is no any other book that is available except then park k park is the book that is always uh, um, better to study for the community medicine so many students that might have a question because uh, why didn't she tell about the fast track or the guidebooks that are available in the market that would make our life so much easy right so um, at last i'd also um, i'll be telling something about the fast track or the notebook that uh, while studying in your first two year of your mbbs or while doing your mbbs right so um, fast tracks are the book that are available in the market as a guidebook and uh, fast track are the um simply a note or notes that are just um, copied from the your standard textbook so um, Personally, there is no any hard, there is no any preferences. Uh, I'll not say anything to anybody who study who doesn't study guidebook, right? So uh, it's all about their choices. And um, personally speaking, I have not studied. Uh, I I didn't study it, uh, fast track during my first year. Yes, I have studied during other um, other years of my MBBS, but uh, for the first year, I have not studied. Uh, um, I used to study textbook uh, only and solely during my exam time also. So I have not studied fast track. But uh, yes, I just uh, recommend every one of you to have a uh, fast track uh, along your side uh, because uh, at the end you need to give an exam. So um, uh, before appearing to the exam, there is no any um there is no any other than uh, memorizing and uh, just writing those things right so um for me fast track um has uh, not played that much role in my mbbs life uh, during the first two years but uh, i rec i recommend uh, every student to take a um, f uh, to have a guidebook because uh, um, there are so many students who are always lost and there will be a uh, lack of time during the exam preparation time is good and uh, if you, it is a very good if you make a notes uh, on those fast track and uh, from your standard textbook and studying side by side it will be very much beneficial for you because um, by doing that you will not miss anything that is written in the standard textbook and it will also do not miss anything that you need to study right during your exam time also so i um i just uh, prefer to every one of you to have fast track because uh, uh, there are many students are uh, there are many of my friends who used to struggle during their exam period so um, i always uh, suggest uh, um uh, every one of you to have uh, everyone not everyone those who like to study those who want to uh, take fast track it's not a bad option and you can always go for the fast track also and but uh, not only fast track you need to study textbook also okay so by saying all those things i will just like to conclude this video and um you can always ask me the question in the comment section below so please don't hesitate or don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and please um share this video to as much as of your friends so that can it can be helpful to your to you as well as your to your friend also so by saying this i'll just meet you all in your my next video till then goodbye guys